It's another day, another controversy for the Red Devils, as VAR continues to play a prominent role in their matches. Seven minutes into the game, United fans were celebrating a rare positive start to an away Premier League match. The ball was crossed from a free kick, and the young Argentine Alejandro Garcho skillfully evaded his marker to put the ball into the area for United's league top scorer, Scott McTimoni, to score the goal. A great way to begin a Saturday noon match, except it wasn't. The visiting fans erupted into a much-needed therapeutic celebration, but it was interrupted when VAR announced it was initiating the dreaded review, and the day's referee, John Brooks, approached to assess the action on the off-field cameras. The familiar feeling of disappointment over another disallowed goal gripped the fan base. But before we continue with the latest VAR controversy, don't forget to subscribe to our channel. Hit the notification button and give us a thumbs up if you're enjoying our content. And be sure to leave your opinion in the comments below. Before today's match, Manchester United had already suffered a net loss of three VAR check decisions, now it's four. No team in the league has had more, according to the American sports network ESPN, which claims that United had five unfavorable decisions before the match against Fulham. Alejandro Garcho, Rasmus Hodgin, Johnny Evans, and now Scott McKinn have become the fourth Red Devil to be denied. Interestingly, during the 2022-23 season, only three teams had more goals disallowed than Manchester United has now. Liverpool had six, while Bournemouth and Aston Villa had five. In contrast, Manchester United had only two goals disallowed in the league. What do you think, is VAR interfering with the games or not? Share your opinion in the comments below. Keep following us for more updates. Thank you for tuning in.